Are you Oi? You are. Oi Stagson. Tell me about yourself, Oi. When I was younger, I was afraid that my malformed arm would mean that I couldn't be an innkeeper. But as it turns out, I can do the job quite well. I'm very proud of what the inn means to Port Dara, even though the crisis means that fewer people now come here. Tell me about your inn. My family has run this inn for many generations. It's a place of rest and relaxation for many a weary traveller, and also the place where the townspeople come to talk, drink, and celebrate. We share the building with Luzin in the inn. Yes, yes, that's true, I'll just talk to him. Our drinks? Uh, we have a very solid selection, nothing like you'd find in Oneropolis. Oneropolis? I don't know. But probably the best you'll find in the Fortunate Isles. Barley wine, Miravore, butterbeer, ooh, butterbeer. Many different kinds of whiskey. Oh, whiskey. Uh, I believe we have a bottle of Welleran's finest somewhere, and the discerning customer may be interested in our Serenian. Serenarian? Serenarian? Stout. I don't know. Food! Got all the traditional meals, so what I'd really recommend is our baked eel monster with crunchy potatoes and garlic. If you're more partial to salads, like myself, I recommend the grass salad with small insects. It's my mother's recipe, and I promise it tastes equally good every time it comes back up. I will pass. Thank you. Okay, um. I think it's going to be a new section now, so I'm going to take a glance at the goals. Find translator, adapter, find a doctor. That, see, that's the thing I can do in town. Are you a doctor? You are. Whoa. Okay. What? Best predicting ever. <laughs> Smell of the day. Ho ho. Because he's a snake. That's racist. Anyway, hi, Dr. Fidus. I am Dr. Fidus, traveling physician from the Isle of the Sun. I travel so that I may learn from the wisdom of others. There can be no healing without knowledge. Do you know where I might get a jellification potion for a cat that sells fish? Jellification potions, yes, I do know how to make them. They can be most useful in preparing certain ingredients. Here, I will copy the recipe for you. Good luck. Thank you. I need to heal Underhome. Can you help that? Help with that. Underhome has been assaulted. The outrage. I was hoping to visit the mysterious druid. I love that name. Seriously, that's amazing. To speak of biotechnology. Whatever is the world coming to. But I will do my best to help you heal the damage. I will give you my recipe for soup of recovery. Cook this in Underhome's kitchen and let it absorb the fumes. The ingredients will be hard to find, but the cause is worthy. Thank you, that will be useful. Now, I need to find an arterial cleaning device. Sadly, I do not know how to make such a thing. Perhaps you should inquire on the Isle of the Stars. I don't know how to get there. Ah, I've got a recipe. That's in here, I think. It's not in there. That's in here, I think. It's not in there. Either. Something green. What is it? It's, it squibbles. It squibbles. I love things that squibble. And it smells of squoo. The mouse says you better. <laughs> Fuck you, mouse. God. So judgmental. Flowers. The flowers got so hungry, they ate the other flower's description. That's not nice. A wear barrier, a wear barrier wax candle. That's even worse than the other. Paintings, a famous town that I once visited. A uh, famous ruin, rather. A great king was crowned here, but few now remember his name. The 
smell of the day. Booze with a hint of seawater. Hello, Manon McLear. It's all gone. All gone. The ship. The horse. The cloak. The sword. No more riding the waves. No more great adventures. No more guiding. No more... Just this now. Replaced me with a hydrofoil that did. Really? Rendered me to Tartarus, but I escaped. Ha! Mm. Didn't do much, much good. Ugh. Tell me about Magmel. Not what it like it used to be. It used to be. <clears throat> it used to be great. It used to be like. like. like coming out of a storm and finding a place of perfect calm. Like the secret places underwater where the octopuses hold their councils. But, look at that. Now it's poor. We're very competitive. We're very proud of being very competitive. Work for food, make toys for tourists, little action figures of old heroes. What of me too? There used to be no hunger. I don't know why, but you're drunk, so I figure it can't hurt. I'm gonna ask you where I might find Niam. My great-granddaughter? Oh, wait, what? That's a coincidence. Huh, she, she was here. I remember. She said... Something. I remember. No, uh, she said... No, I forgot. No, wait. She, she went. She went. She went. To the Isle of the Sun. I wish I could have given my old Kura. Maybe I need more ale. And for those wondering, a Kura is a boat. It's an Irish kind of boat. And I know that because I'm Irish. What are these? Salt and pepper shakers. The salt is in the pepper shaker and the pepper is in the salt shaker. Salt shaker, not the salt shaker. Hmm. So... Exotic drinks. Glasses. Yeah, okay, so if those are the exotic drinks, what are the normal ones? Spiced Brivari. Absence with a hint of green moat. Perpendicular Polk. Oak flavored Ent Draft. A big bottle of Glendular Slime. A small bottle of Splurg. Hmm. A minty sort of drinky. A distilled goulash. Okay, I'm I'm done. I'm done. A spiky thing. They really they really do grow everywhere. What the fuck are you? Patrick or Leprechaun. Smell of the day shoes. That's not pleasant. Tell me about yourself, Patrick. My name's Patrick. Patrick or oh, Leprechaun. Yes, I'm from America. I came here because I just couldn't stand the stereotypes anymore. Here I'm just another citizen. Back home, everyone was making such a big point in my heritage. Of being a leprechaun, I always had to wear green clothing and a big beard and talk with an accent like I'm doing now. It was terrible. You can only have an identity when no one cares about your identity. What do you think of Portera? I love it here, even though it's not you know, worked out really well for me. But it's beautiful. As a child, I always heard about Port Dara from my uncle when he visited us. But until I actually set foot on the Isle of the Moon, I hadn't really been able to imagine what it would be like. Are you hungry, Patrick or Leprechaun? Man, this is embarrassing, but uh, could you... I'm the innkeeper. Oi... Okay, relax, Patrick, relax. The thing is, I'm really hungry. I haven't had anything to eat in a while. I don't have any money. I used to work in the mayor's office, but the new mayor fired me. New mayor? That's something interesting. New mayor fired me because the state employees drained the economy. I could barely live from the money I made then, but now... Yeah. So, maybe you could ask Oi the innkeeper if you could give me some left. I can do that for you, yes, right now. Patrick wants food. Why doesn't he just come in and talk to me? What is it with all this shyness? It's completely unnecessary. I've forgotten what voice I did for him. I'm sorry. 
These are hard times and people should help each other. Here, give him this and tell him to stop being silly. I got a meal for Patrick. Oh, I can't eat it though. That's a shame. Scroll of recipes. Eat it. <laughs> you're not supposed to use the... You're, oh, wait. You're supposed to use the recipes to make things you can eat or drink. Not eat or drink the recipes themselves. What do you think? I was... The mouse says that modern recipes are all well and good, but real cooking requires more than written instructions. I suppose you're right. Patrick! Hey there, how are you? Hungry! No. <laughs> A full meal? Oh, wow. I didn't... I says... I, I, I didn't expect so much kindness. Sorry, I don't want to embarrass you getting all emotional here. It's just that no one's really done this kind of thing for me before. I, I always thought the world was, you know, dog and dog and all of that. Thank you. Thank you. Both of you. You and Oi. Oh, would you like to have this? It's an ancient token of some kind. I found it hidden in one of my uncle's old shoes. What, you steal from your family? Really? Fuck you. I got Patrick's token. I mean, I'll take it from you, sure, but seriously, you're a dick. Uh, things. This is the town hall, right? Yeah. What goals do we have? Get a carrot. Okay. I can get that. Hereabouts. I need a carrot and apparently a leek. I will gladly trade you as many carrots and leeks as you want in exchange for your help. I'm out of fertilizer, and the type I use is no longer available. <coughs> Don't want to use the unhealthy stuff that Lord Urizen's people recommend. So I need someone to get more of the good kind. It's called bat guano, and can also often be found in caves. That's lovely, but I suppose it's accurate. I also need hot peppers. Hot peppers? No, I'm sorry, I only have regular peppers. Hot peppers aren't very popular in Dara. It might have something to do with uh, the time I accidentally sold those volatile piquant... Piquant? Piquant? I don't know. Peppers as mild peppers and gave everyone incendiary bowel syndrome. Wow, okay. Don't do that again. Barrels! A huge barrel! A plant. Boxes. A bird. <laughs> the bird is lost in thought. What's over this way? Oh, whoa, what? That is a bird in a hat and a crab. Mr. Crab. Dada chum. Mr. Crab. Dada chalk. Are you in debt, Mr. Crab? Dada champ. What do you think of the Fortunate Isles, Mr. Crab? Dead attack? Would you tell me your opinions on Port Dara, Mr. Crab? Dead attack? Don't brag about it, man. Kiss and tell, that's not cool. Mr. Bird! Oh. Captain Pelargos. Help! I see you've come from a long way. And your journey is likely to take you all across the fortune tiles. I would therefore like to offer you my ship to you in exchange for your help. You almost certainly know that our island is in debt, and though the causes are hard to understand, the results are likely to be terrible. I'm an old stork and people are walking into my room, so I'm going to pause the recording again so they can do their thing.